Hi, welcome back to Food Review. So, in today's episode of Food Review, we have something exciting <laughs> and also kind of terrifying. So, right here, we have a stick of like jerky or something. It's not your average kind. It's supposedly supposed to be. It's supposed to be ghost pepper, which is very interesting, <laughs> but also very scary because I haven't tried anything like this before. I don't think it's gonna be as bad as like a straight like pepper or spice, but I have built a pretty good spice tolerance to stuff like tahini, and I think that this is gonna be painful, but also fun. You can tell that there's some pretty intimidating fact in got this, you know, skull and he has like the fire and you got this like hitchhiker dude. Try <laughs> and. Because I'm ready for this to be extremely painful, we have a plastic cup full of ice cream. And we have the chalice. The chalice is back and it's full of water. So, yeah, let's try this. It has like a whole kind of tablet down. Cheese stick. So, how does it smell? So, it's gonna be the concerning part. It smells exactly the same as the other one. I had another one that wasn't spicy and it was pretty good. Wish me luck. Okay. There's like, <coughs> I was about to say the first taste wasn't that bad, but it spice it got really deep in my throat. Yeah, this is definitely a step up. If this is actual like a ghost pepper. It's not like I, I I doubt it's like as spicy as a ghost pepper. It is pretty spicy, but I think I've built a pretty good spice tolerance, so this isn't like as bad as I expected it to be. Yeah, a real spice from like the juices. And after you swallow it, that's what the painful part. Sweating a little bit. That's usual if I taste something like above my spice tolerance. I got some mint from my favorite. It's very white on camera and white in real life. I promise it's mint. I'll take a few more bites before I give it the final verdict. But you know, it doesn't taste spicy at first. Once you swallow it, you get that aftertaste. That's the killer. I was expecting this to be a lot worse. That either means one of two things. This isn't like actual proper spicy ghost pepper, or it's like not as spicy as real ghost pepper, or I just have a pretty high spice tolerance now. Who knows? What well, Takis and Takis and phase off. I'm definitely gonna be eating more uh, jerky. I used to never be a huge fan of it, but it's really good actually. Alright. Uh, for the final verdict, spice wise, <coughs> so I think for spice, I would give this rating of, I'd say this is about like, I don't know, 5 out of 10, 6 out of 10. Really not incredibly spicy, like, I was expecting to be in incredible pain, and I'm not. That's pretty good. This is pretty tasty. <laughs> Taste-wise, pretty good. Um, like I said before, I'm not a huge fan of, like, jerky kind of stuff like this, but this was really good, actually. I really like this. Taste-wise, I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. It's not, like, best thing ever. I will definitely be eating more jerky, because I did really like this. Overall rating, I'd give this mm, 14 out of 20. And with that, we conclude today's food review. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying the food review style of content. And I'm going to enjoy some ice cream now. Bye.